Hello my girls. Today I am in Kitose Kurasiyama. It's about 20 minutes from Shinjuku and it's my friend's house. She has her own Lolita brand. She's Japanese and she makes Lolita dresses and Lolita wedding dresses. She's been published in magazines like Keda and she's her brand's getting really popular. So now and then she has a Lolita tea party and she invites a bunch of people. And um, she speaks English a little bit and her sister used to live in America. So it's just a nice place for our foreign Lolitas to go. So today we're just going to have tea and she's going to show us how to make a headdress. I'm really excited. Today my outfit is bear themed and it's actually themed around Duffy who's my favorite Disney C character. And I have their ears and this, I think it's like a Pasmo case for um, your train card and I have this one he was wearing clothes but they didn't match my outfit so I took them off and now he feels kind of obscene <laughs> and my dress is Charlotte's Bear by AP there's little bears on it Now we're just chilling just and talking with the girls. So they're here and eating our cake. I'm gonna wait for my tea though. Cake time. It's really cute. The place like Sakura and the cups also like Sakura print. It's really cute. We got a gift too. Like a Japanese friend right here. I'm breaking her in slowly. I'm scared. <laughs> but yeah, everyone's a little bit shy at the moment. So they're really talking. But uh, once the tea starts flowing and I uh, spike it with some whiskey, then serve the tea. <laughs> Serve that tea. Simokita as usual, after everyone has some tea and chats and takes pictures, we go outside and we have a photo shoot in the sunlight. The house is very beautiful. It's an old Japanese house, but it's kind of European style, so it really fits that Lolita aesthetic. This is one of Hiroko's designs. She did a Cinderella themed Lolita dress. <laughs> These accessories are part of a collaboration that Hidoko is doing with another brand. So we're able to buy these today. And these are what we'll be using to build our headdresses today. This is the photo book from Hidoko's last collection show. And the model is Misako Aoki. And the pictures are so beautiful. We start off with the headdress base. There's different designs and everybody has to pick one. I'll pick this one with flowers on. It already has the clip attached for us. We will be using scissors, a hot glue gun, and this headdress base, which is just cloth with the clip on. This is what we'll be making. We're going to choose what we want to use for our headdresses. Oh, I like these chicks. There's a pink fuzzy one. It's really cute. There is a pink hedgehog. It's not a drill. I'm 
finished and it looks ridiculous. I love it. Oh, it's gorgeous. They used pink chicks. Oh. <laughs> I'm really happy with the final product. It looks really cool. I think that I can wear this with Lolita and maybe Liz Lisa, but because it's almost spring and we're gonna wear kimono for the cherry blossoms, I kind of want to wear it as like a kangashi. It's really cool.